What's up guys, I'm back. I've been away due to a number of stuff. Uh, and also Instagram, that's kept me busy. Thought I'd try that. Uh, it's been quite fun actually. Anyway, um, I'm doing splashback. So what I've done there, um, I've measured out the central tile, which is there. And then I measured out how far it goes and so on. So for now, I'm just going to keep the tiles uh, as they are. Uh, I'm not going to cut them, score them, anything. Just going to keep the tiles and it's just going to be uh, two lots. So one there there and one there above. <laughs> that will be the splashback. Uh, the same tiles, these ones. <laughs> yep, these ones. Now, obviously, as you can see, they're kind of all over the places, right? Well, not all over the places, but, you know, off line and whatever. Anyway, first time ever. So, not gonna make the same mistake. Oh yes, did more plastering because uh, we moved that to here. So, basically, all I've done, as you can see, um, marked my parameters and I've scored it. Simple as. Just went a bit crazy. Uh, you can use whatever you want. I just use chisel to score that. I'll hoover the mess, don't worry. So I scored that. What I'm gonna do now, I got, PVA mixed here, okay. Uh, it's kind of like two parts PVA, three parts water. Actually, maybe a bit more, maybe four parts water, something like that. Apply that over this, and that should basically the idea of it is to uh, bond and bind the loose bits uh, onto the wall. So when I put the tile on it will stick better less chance of it you know just uh, coming off so yes that's the reason why the reason why I scored it is because again so the tile adhes adhesive has something to grab onto rather than just a like plain smooth surface so this will have uh, you know it'll give it sort of a teeth to grab onto so this is it that's that This is the, whew, I'm out of breath, uh, tile adhesive. I only mixed a small amount, as you can see, so that I can control, um, you know, so that I don't have to rush, actually. Um, and, and obviously, they tend to set quickly, so that's the main reason why, even though I've, I've only got only six tiles to put on. But that, anyway, um, I may have to mix a bit more. That's fine. I'd rather do little at a time. That way, I get a better control of the work that I'm doing. Um, I've learned that from my previous mistake, as you can see. Uh, the big mistake tells the story, doesn't it? So yes, um, I just mixed it with that, letting it set. Read the instruction, um, and what I'll do, I'll see if I get to show you. I'll just um, use the spatula to spread this mix adhesive onto the tile, the back on the, obviously the back of the tile, and then I'll use this trowel to spread it. And then just a matter of sticking it on. I'm going to start from the middle and then work my way up and then to the sides. That's it. The reason why I've done that, as you can see on the two ends, there is a, there's a gap there and there. That's because of the way the sink is, sink, uh, is designed. Anyhow, so I'm going to do the tiling and I cut out an, a board, 9mm off cut board uh, around it. So then this is where the tile is going to sit on and then I'll just. Um, I'll, I'll just carry on with this uh, tiling. That way I'll get a straight finish. Uh, that's the whole purpose behind it. Instead of using a baton. Right guys, I just realized I should have covered the top of the sink because the adhesive is really sticky and that's going to be a pain to remove if it sticks on it. So I'm using a off cut again. Uh, hopefully that prevents stuff from, you know, spillage in that. Anyway, let's go. Let's do this. Uh, like so, take my mix, just gently pour it over. Um, I mean, you can use a trowel, but at this point, I just want to get that stuff all over it, and then I'll use a trowel. Another blender, I need something to rest my trowel. 
like so. Need more, obviously. And so I'll go again. Um, buy more. Like so, press it in, press it out to the wall, and that's your, and that's it. You use the spaces. Do it that way even. And then next one up, off you go, that's it. See that nail over there, just there, that is there to hold that piece in, in place because it was, it was actually the top, yeah, top of that piece, or the top of that tile was shifting out that way. So that's just to keep that checked in. So that's nice and straight now and that's done. Me splashback's done.